In previous editions of the High Desert Region Economic Update, we've looked at how clean energy technology can provide jobs and boost the economy. But not everybody recognizes another huge benefit, education. The Bright Source Energy Ivanpah Solar Project offers a textbook example. Knowing that today's students will be tomorrow's scientists, engineers, and developers, Bright Source has reached out to local school systems. The company has held seminars for students and worked closely with the Mojave Environmental Education Consortium, known as MEEK. Bright Source is a very strong partner with MEEK in that they're allowing us the um, capabilities and the financial means plus the information to bring renewable energy education to our schools. Bright Source participated in a Youth Environmental Leadership Conference for High Desert Area students between grades 3 and 12. Project Manager Todd Stewart led the Bright Source team and emphasized the importance of introducing young people to clean energy technology. It's absolutely critical that we get involved with the community as we as we move forward with our first project in San Bernardino County. Bright Source can make solar power actually real for the kids in this community. And we look at the, at the kids in the community as being the next generation, the source of who's going to be building these power plants, who's going to be operating these power plants. And when they see what it looks like in the real world, it helps them understand how solar power and other renewables actually helps the environment and get away from using fossil fuels for all of our energy generation. I look at, at the, the kids today and I, and I look at what the needs are going to be in the future and the future needs for kids involved in engineering and sciences is going to be huge and there's going to be a, a, a dramatic shortfall of kids in the, in the United States to fill those jobs. And if I can influence a few of them to consider a, a future in environmental, mathematics, engineering, or sciences, uh, it helps America address the future, the future needs in, or in country rather than importing our expertise. When I look at the environmental issues in front of us as a society, there is something I take very, very seriously. In fact, my entire adult life has been spent focused on these issues. I started with a master's in environmental planning, and I've always tried to think through, even as the Iroquois do, seven generations out. How do you think ahead to your impact on future generations? Of course, it's never uh, driven home as personally until you have your own children and you start to think through what their life is going to be like. And if you look at the single biggest threat to any of us and our children and their children, it's climate change. Climate change is something that we all need to think about. It's going to be the biggest threat to species and habitat over time. And I've committed my life, and I think it's one of the most important issues to address over time, is how we mitigate that in a thoughtful and responsible manner through renewable power. I am absolutely thrilled that Bright Source is going to be able to present an opportunity for our students to actually visit on site a solar plant learn the technology, see for themselves. It's place-based learning. It doesn't get much better than that. If you can spark the interest of one student in going into that field, that's 100% of our job done. So we're absolutely delighted that Bright Source will be opening its doors for our students and teachers to actually tour the facility in Ivanpah. When finished, the Bright Source Energy Project at Ivanpah will be the largest solar thermal facility in the world it will nearly double the amount of commercial solar thermal electricity produced in the United States today. We'll take a look at the environmental considerations of the Ivanpah Project in our next edition of the High Desert Region Economic Update.